June of 2023, my family and I had made plans to take a Mediterranean cruise that would leave port from Svetia, Italy, and end in Barcelona. We flew to Rome the day before departure. We had less than a day to see some of the sights around Rome. For my wife and I, we had been to Rome about 17 years earlier. This would be the first time traveling with our two teenage boys. My wife did find out that getting to the Vatican very early in the morning was a way to beat the crowds and spend quality time at the St. Peter's Basilica, and that worked out perfectly. We arrived at 7 a.m., there was no line, got through security, and we were able to spend a couple hours walking around. Rome is an amazing city, but one thing we did not really plan for were the crowds. And not only that, but getting reserved tickets for attractions like going into the Colosseum or the Pantheon and the Sistine Chapel. All were booked solid the day we were there without any admissions being offered. This is unless you were willing to pay people that were walking in the line saying they could get you in. We did not know if they were legit or not, so we passed. So please let this be a lesson. Get tickets early if you plan on visiting Rome. For some reason, I was thinking these things are just open to the public all day and you could just buy tickets and walk in. That was not the case. Coliseum. Uh, a little disappointing. A little disappointing. There's construction everywhere. This thing looks old. They don't keep it up. It Four, Airbnb. Three, three stars, guys. Three stars. So there's, it's broken. It's falling apart. There's cracks at the top. It's missing. Cracks everywhere. It's hot. It's crowded. The upkeep is mid at best. The place is literally falling apart. They're not keeping it up. Three stars, Coliseum, three stars. Do better. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe to be notified of more European travel videos and to check out some of my other videos of my travels here in the United States, including an entire series on Route 66. Thanks for watching.